The GM High Feature Engine, also known as the HFV6, and including the 3600 LY7 and derivative LP1, is a family of modern General Motors DOHC V6 engines. The series was introduced in 2004 with the Cadillac CTS. It is a 60 degrees 24 valve design with aluminum block and heads and sequential multi-port fuel injection. Most versions feature continuously variable cam phasing on both intake and exhaust valves and electronic throttle control. Other features include piston oil jet capability, forged and fillet rolled crankshaft, center forged connecting rods, a variable length intake manifold, twin knock control sensors and coil on plug ignition. It was developed by the same international team responsible for the Ecotec, including the Opel engineers responsible for the 54 degrees V6, with involvement with design and development engineering from Ricardo plc. Holden sells the HFV6 under the name Aloytec. The high feature moniker on the Holden produced engine is reserved for the twin cam phasing high output version. The block was designed to be expandable from 2.8L to 4.0L. High feature V6 engines were previously produced in Fisherman's Bend, Port Melbourne, Australia, and remain in production at the following four manufacturing locations St. Catharines, Canada, Flint Engine South in Flint, Michigan, United States, Romulus Engine Plant in Romulus, MI and Ramos Arispe, Coahuila, Mexico. The assembly lines for the St. Catharines and Flint facilities were manufactured by Harada Corporation at their powertrain facility in Kumamoto, Japan. Most of the designs of this motor happened in Flint. They were first produced for the Cadillac range. Topic. History The HFV6 was first designed, tested and produced in a joint program by Cadillac and Holden. A majority of designs into the new alloy construction, transmission pairing and first use in production were all undertaken in Detroit and manufactured in St. Catharines, Ontario. Holden had the job of developing smaller engines Holden 3.2, LP1 and Saab 2.8, LP9 Turbo as well as their own Holden 3.6 HF V6 called the Aloytec V6 for local models. Cadillac and Holden both tested variations of these engines in US and Australia. Equals <laughs> equals two. 8 equals equals topic LP1 A 2.8L 2792 cc LP1 variant was introduced in the 2005 Cadillac CTS It was also used on the Chinese 2008 CTS it has a 89 mm x 74.8 mm 3.50 in x 2.94 in bore and stroke, sequential multi-port fuel injection and a 10.0, 1 compression ratio. The LP1 was built in St. Catharines, Ontario. Applications Topic. LP9 This engine is also known as a A28NET, Z28NET, Z28NEL or B284. The LP9 is a 2.8L turbocharged version used for the Saab 9-3, Saab 9-5 and other GM vehicles. It has the same bore and stroke as the naturally aspirated LP1, however the compression ratio is reduced to 9.5, 1. 
The engine is manufactured at Holden's Fisherman's Bend Engine Factory in Port Melbourne, Australia, while GM Powertrain Sweden formerly Saab Automobile Powertrain is responsible for turbocharging the engine. Global versions of this engine use the same horsepower rating for both metric and imperial markets, mechanical horsepower, while the Europe-only versions are rated in metric horsepower. Applications Topic. Lao The Lao is GM's new code for the LP9 turbo engine, its usage starting with the 2010 Cadillac SRX. In 2011, production of the Cadillac SRX with the Lao engine ceased, but the engine remained in use in the Saab 9-4X until 2012, when production of that model came to an end. Applications equals equals 3. 0 equals equals Topic LF1 The LF1 is a 3.0-liter version with a bore and stroke of 89 mm x 80.3 mm in x 3.16 in produced between 2010 and 2014 equipped with Spark Ignition Direct Injection and a 11.7, 1 compression ratio. Applications. Topic LFW. The LFW is a flexible fuel version of the LF1, capable of running on E85, gasoline, or any mixture of the two. Output is identical to the LF1. Applications. Topic 3.2. Holden has built its own 3.2L version of the high-feature engine in Australia produced between 2005 and 2010 with a bore and stroke of 89mm x 85.6mm in x 3.37 in. Branded with the Aloytech name like the 3.6 liter version, this version produces 227 horsepower, 169 kilowatts, 230 PS at 6600 revolutions per minute and 297 Nm, 219 pound feet at 3200 revolutions per minute. It has a 10.3 1 compression ratio. Its fuel economy is 4 to 6 kilometers per liter, 11 to 17 mpg imp, 9.4 to 14.1 mpg US in city, and 7 to 9 kilometers per liter, 20 to 25 mpg imp, 16 to 21 mpg US on highway. Holden also produced the 3.2L engines that were used by Alfa Romeo as the basis of its JTS V6 engine. Applications 2006-2010 Daewoo Windstorm, Chevrolet Captiva, Holden Captiva 2006-2010 Opel Antara, Daewoo Windstorm Max, Holden Captiva Max Suzuki Grand Vitara equals equals 3 6 equals equals topic LY7 The 3.6L 217.5 cu in 3564cc LY7 engine was introduced in the 2004 Cadillac CTS sedan. It has a 10.2 1 compression ratio, a bore and a stroke of 94 mm x 85.6 mm, 3.70 in x 3.37 in. 
Lower powered versions only have variable cam phasing on the inlet cam Leo. Selected models also include variable exhaust. The engine weighs 370 pounds, 170 kilograms as installed. This engine is produced in several locations: St. Catharines, Ontario, Flint Engine South, Michigan, Melbourne, Australia, Ramos Arispe, Mexico, and Sagara, Japan, by Suzuki. Suzuki's engine designation is N36A. A dual fuel 235 horsepower, 175 kilowatts, 238 PS version able to run on petrol and autogas (LPG) has also been produced by Holden in Australia. Applications. Topic LLT. The 3.6L LLT is a direct injected version based on the earlier LY7 engine. It was first unveiled in May 2006, and the D version was claimed to have 15% greater power, 8% greater torque, and 3% better fuel economy than its port injected counterpart. The LLT engine has a compression ratio of 11.3.1, and has been certified by the SE to produce 302 horsepower, 225 kilowatts, 306 PS at 6,300 revolutions per minute and 272 pound-feet, 369 Nm of torque at 5,200 revolutions per minute on regular unleaded, 87 octane gasoline. This engine debuted on the 2008 Cadillac STS and CTS. GM used a LLT in all 2009 Lambda-derived crossover SUVs to allow class-leading fuel economy in light of the new corporate average fuel economy CAFE standards. In the Lambdas, LLT engine produces 288 horsepower, 215 kilowatts, 292 PS, and 270 pound-feet, 366 Nm of torque. Applications. Topic LFX. The LFX is an enhanced version of the LLT engine. Introduced in the MY2012 Chevrolet Camaro LS, it is 20.5 pounds lighter than the LLT, due to a redesigned cylinder head and integrated exhaust manifold, and composite intake manifold. Other components like the fuel injectors, intake valves, and fuel pump have also been updated. Power and torque are up slightly from the LLT. The compression ratio is 11.5.1. The LFX also features E85 flex fuel capability. Applications Topic. LWR The LWR is dedicated LPG 3.6 liter engine. Introduced in the MY2012 Holden Commodore, based on the 3.6 liter LY7 engine, the LWR had a vapor injection system. The vapor injection system injected gas directly into the air intake runner, thereby preventing excess gas from circulating through the air intake system. Although liquid LPG injection generally produces more power, Holden justified vapor injection on the grounds of lower fuel consumption, lower CO2 emissions, reduced pumping and parasitic losses, and startup reliability in hot weather. The dedicated LPG LWR engine produced peak power and torque of 180 kilowatts, 245 PS, 241 horsepower at 6000 revolutions per minute and 320 Nm, 236 pound-feet at 2000 revolutions per minute. 
The LWR engine was engine was mated to GM 6-speed six 6L45 six automatic transmission and, over the combined ADR81-02 test cycle, the Commodore Omega achieved fuel consumption of 11.8L, 100 km 24 mpg imp, 19.9 mpg US an improvement of 1.6L, 100 km 180 mpg imp, 150 mpg US compared to its dual fuel LW2 predecessor. Furthermore, the LWR engine exceeded Euro 6 emissions standards. Specially hardened valves and valve seats. A redesigned cylinder head and manifold for improved air flow. Variable exhaust valve timing The LW2 engine only had variable intake valve timing Specially developed fuel injectors New pistons with Pentroof-style center domes and valve eyelets for a higher compression ratio of 12.2.1 compared to 10.2.1 for the dual fuel engine A new fuel rail and a new LPG fuel filter Applications Topic LCS The 3.6L 3564 cc LCS is derived from the direct injected LLT for use in hybrids using the two mode system Differences from the LLT include a slightly lower compression ratio, 11.3.1, and lower power and torque peaks. It was to debut in the 2009 Saturn View Hybrid, where it would make 262 horsepower, 195 kilowatts, 266 PS at 6,100 revolutions per minute and 250 pound-feet, 339 Nm of torque at 4,800 revolutions per minute. Fuel economy 6 to 8 kilometers per liter, 17 to 23 mpg m, 14 to 19 mpg US in city, 911 kilometer per liter, 25 to 31 mpg m, 21 to 26 mpg US on highway. Applications. 2009 Saturn View Hybrid product cancelled. Topic LF3 The 3.6L twin turbocharged version for the 2014 Cadillac CTS and 2014 Cadillac XTS has been announced at the 2013 NYAS. The engine is rated at 420 horsepower, 313 kilowatts, 426 PS of power at 5750 revolutions per minute and 430 pound-feet, 583 Nm of torque at 3 500 to 4,500 revolutions per minute with 90% of torque being available at 2,500 to 5,500 revolutions per minute and helps the CTS achieve 0 to 60 miles per hour 0 to 97 kilometers per hour time of 4.6 seconds with an 8-speed automatic transmission. In essence, the twin-turbo 3.6 LV6 is the force-inducted variant of the popular LFX V6 currently found in the Cadillac ATS, XTS, and SRX, among many other GM models, with several important upgrades, including All-new cylinder block casting All-new cylinder head castings Strengthened connecting rods Forged steel crankshaft Continuously variable valve timing Large 38.3 mm in intake valves and 30.6 mm in sodium-filled exhaust valves Machined, domed aluminum pistons with top steel ring carrier for greater strength 10 2 to 1 compression ratio 
patented, integrated charge air cooler system with low volume air ducts. Twin turbochargers produce more than 12 psi 83 kilopascals. Vacuum actuated wastegates with electronic control valves. All new direct injection fuel system. Tuned air inlet and outlet resonators, aluminum cam covers and other features that contribute to exceptional quietness and smoothness applications. Topic LF4 The LF4 is a higher performance variant of the LF3 for use in the Cadillac ATS-V. Changes to the LF3 include Turbochargers with low inertia titanium aluminide turbines and vacuum actuated wastegates for more responsive torque production. Compressors matched for peak efficiency at peak power levels, for optimal track performance. Patent pending low volume charge cooling system that optimizes packaging efficiency and maximizes boost pressure. Lightweight titanium connecting rods that reduce inertia of the rotating assembly, complementing the quick spooling turbochargers. Peak boost increased to 18 psi, 1.2 bars, from 12 psi, 0. 83 bars. Higher flow fuel injectors. Oil pan baffling for better oil flow at high cornering speeds applications. Topic LFR. The LFR is a bi-fuel variant of the LFX, although multi-point fuel injection is used for both the gasoline and CNG instead of direct injection. Applications. Topic LFY. The LFY is similar to the LFX, but adds stop-start technology and has improved airflow. Applications Topic. Fourth generation Starting with 2016 Cadillac models a new generation of high-feature V6s were developed. These new engines have redesigned block architectures with bore centers increased from 103 mm in on prior HFV6 engines to 106 mm in and a redesigned cooling system to target the hottest areas while also facilitating faster warm-up. They also incorporate engine start-stop technology, cylinder deactivation, two-stage oil pumps, and updated variable valve timing featuring intermediate park technology for late intake valve closure. Both engines debuted in the 2016 Cadillac CT6. Equals 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 three zero L equals equals equals. Topic LGW Bore and stroke of 86 mm times 85.8 mm 3.39 in times 3.38 in are used, along with a 9.8, 1 compression ratio and twin turbos with titanium aluminide turbine wheels. Maximum engine speed is 6,500 rpm. Premium unleaded fuel is required. Applications equals 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 three six L equals 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 Topic LGX 
Along with the increased bore spacing, the new 3.6 LD V6 has larger bores than before, growing from 94 mm in to 95 mm in with the same 85.8 mm in stroke as the 3.0 LLGW, for a displacement of 3.6 L 49 cc. Intake and exhaust valves are also increased in size along with other changes to the cylinder head. Compression ratio is 11.5, 1 and maximum engine speed is 7200 rpm. Applications Topic. LGZ. The LGZ is a variant of the LGX designed for pickup truck use. Applications Topic V12 On March 21, 2007 AutoWeek reported that GM was planning to develop a 60-degree V12 based on this engine family to power the top version of Cadillac's upcoming flagship sedan. This Cadillac would essentially have had two 3.6L high-feature V6s attached crankshaft to crankshaft and would have featured high-end technologies including direct injection and cylinder deactivation. If so, the twin engine would have displaced 7.2 liters and produced approximately 600 horsepower, 447 kilowatts, 608 PS and 540 pound-feet, 732 Nm of torque. Development of the engine was reportedly being conducted in Australia by Holden. In August 2008, GM announced that development of the V12 had been cancelled. Topic. See also List of GM engines GM high-value engine GM ultra engine